as his Damani Cricket Club prevailed over Sion Lions in the finals of the National Men's T20 League in a competitive encounter at Chambogo Cricket Oval. Both sides defeated their semi-final opponents in the morning, with the Lions taking the harder route against Challengers, a side which had a number of big names. They managed to kick them out by 50 runs. On the other hand, Aziz Daman simply walked over Wanderers by 87 runs. It was that simple. They didn't have any challenge in there. However, one might say them having an easier route to the final helped them because when the final came in, they won the toss and elected to bat first. They started well, uh, wicket started uh, falling, but Captain Saudi Islam and uh, wicket keeper Fred Achram, hey, they are good display, helped them to push up to 164 runs. That was enough to seal the win. And uh, when the chess came in, the Lions came hard with Kenyan international Alex Obanda hitting hard up front. By the second wicket partnership of Robinson Obia and Captain Deus Mumoza took the game to Aziz Damani and when Marilia time was turning to go to Damani's camp, Obia simply didn't keep his cool and when Obia's wicket fell, that slowed down the chase leaving a lot of work to only the captain, that is um, Homuza, who remained unbeaten, by the way, with 63 runs. That, on a personal note, was good for him, but it wasn't enough for, for his team. And in the end, they lost the final by 20 runs. Uh, I could say these 20 runs, they had everything in control, especially in the first inning, when they were fielding. But somehow, two expensive overs, to be safe, let me say, the sponsor, uh, who considered 25 runs from two overs. If you see the loss of a uh, margin of 20 runs, really, they were in there. They would have been the champions. On a light note, Cricket Queen's opener, Simon Cesars, was crowned MVP of the tournament. He is a man on a mission. And this has been evident for now a year plus. From this lefty, his blade is on fire. For those who've been wondering, okay, now this league, we heard little about it. Yes, this is the league that was stopped last year in June because of COVID. And then they simply paused it and it continued in December. And as we speak, now we have a champion in Aziz Damani securing fourth title on a bounce. Yeah, there's competition in there. Why? They have majority of the national team players, as in they have the cream of the cream. Money is in there and it's an organized team so already they deserve to win big because I mean you win off the pitch the moment you come to the pitch you're already winners but being sports that brotherhood has to come in after battling on the pitch and after the crowning ceremony hey all these players were hugging smiling enjoying drinks and bites you know that's the beauty of sports embracing your enemy you know a guy who gave you an awkward bouncer and then here yeah, you're tossing a beer with him finishing the, uh, the year on top is, uh, is a big uh, step for us coming out of uh, covid and then the trophies for the ladies and the, and, uh, the men's team